Hey all, and welcome back for another Hellfire Comms Patreon TV Com. Today we're checking out the seventh episode of the seventh season of Arrow. Does this one have a name? I have the Wikipedia page open here. I believe it's called The Slabside Redemption. Ooh, it came out November 26, 2018. That's two days after my birthday. Nice. So, let's get right on into it. Sinking instructions, etc. are in the video description. If you need them, check it out. Here we go. In three, two, one. Now, I know we've covered episodes of um, Flash before, at least Volk and I did. I'm not sure if we've actually watched Arrow outside of crossovers and whatnot. Yeah, uh, yeah, you and Volk did this Arrowverse stuff. I, I, uh, I wasn't around. Uh, I, I've seen scattered episodes of Flash. Uh, and I know the vague idea of, like, Arrowverse oh. and all that. Uh, I know they did Crisis on Infinite Earths uh, pretty recently. Yeah. That was cool that Brad and Ralph came back for that. Yeah, and Kevin Conroy. Yeah, there you go. Uh, as a live-action Batman. Yeah, how dare you eat dinner? Get in that hole. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's probably right. I'm just going to seethe with anger for a little bit. <laughs> like, I have no idea what's going on. I have no idea who plays who. I'm pretty sure that's Oliver, a.k.a. Green Arrow. Ollie. Ah, big fan of Green Arrow from uh, Justice League, the cartoon. Yeah. That's kind of like the archetype of Green Arrow in my mind, the iconic one. Yeah, uh, they, they even managed to, uh, uh, the fact that he's, like, uh, you know what's the weird thing about Green Arrow is that, uh, writers, like, one of his weird consistent character traits is that he's, like, uh, he's some flavor of liberal Yeah, left he's a huge, politic. huge fucking libtard is what he is. <laughs> exactly. Uh, so they, they go back and forth as to what flavor he tends to argue with people. Uh, they even, uh, brought it to the point where it even showed up in the Justice League cartoon where he says, yeah, I'm an old school lefty. Yeah, that's, uh, there you go. Which is, uh, you know, you won't, you don't expect to hear that in a, in a show ostensibly, uh, well, not for kids, really, but, you know, for appropriate to watch for all ages. Oh my god. Crooked. Not like that. Crooked cops. Ugh. Thought I was watching something yeah. pure. Honestly. So yeah, that's uh, Ollie with the beard. Green Arrow. That was Diaz who organized the shootings and whatnot. Right. I've got a name like Echo. Sounds pretty rad, actually. So, uh, from what I know, uh, Ollie, uh, exposed his identity as the Green Arrow to the public. Ah. And, uh, turned himself in. Okay. Uh, to, uh, I believe, to, like, some, you know, some vague idea of, like, protecting, uh, his support crew. Yeah. His people. Yep. yep, yep, yep. And now he's, and now, you know, they're not trapped. He's not trapped in there with them. They're trapped in here with them. I see, yep. Rorschach is not an idol. You should not worship him. I'm just pointing it out there. You really shouldn't. <laughs> I'm too cool. Like an arrow, I'm straight as a line. And I'm still very cool when my arrow has a boxing glove attached to it. I like how he's not allowed to have too many wounds on his face, but this guy can be as <laughs> fucked up as he likes. <laughs> it's a possibility that Ollie is just a better fighter and got hit less, but I like my idea more. Yeah. Why is our table so well lit and conspicuously free of other people? Well, it's easier to shoot it that way. Well, you know... <clears throat> 
uh, all the criminals know he he was the Green Arrow. That they're probably giving him a wide berth. Well, he doesn't have arrows on his person. He's not a superhuman. <laughs> uh, he, he can still. He's still very good at punching people. Okay, I thought I saw Vinnie Jones in the credits. I was like, is that the actual dude? I'm the juggernaut, bitch. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> Fucking Britain personified, so it is. <laughs> you know, I know Captain Boomerang actually appeared as an Arrow villain. Mm-hmm. Uh, and not Flash villain. Which is... Very weird. Yeah, that's odd, because, like, he's a member of the Flash's rogues gallery. Yeah, but he also... he He's also Suicide Squad, I guess. So. Yeah, it's interchangeable. I, I don't have an encyclopedic knowledge of Flash stuff, but I, I would say I'm more into it than I am Green Arrow. Yeah. I mean, Flash's rogue gallery is probably, like, the second best to Batman. It is strong, yeah. Uh, Mark Hamill was trickster. Yes, he was. He off your medication That's again. Good. You wear in the suit. That was a great episode. <laughs> yeah, that that, that 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 was a far more charitable and uh, sympathetic interpretation. Yeah. Uh, Mark Hamill's trickster in in the in Flash was just like a serial killer. I'm pretty sure. Mm-hmm. So I'm letting you go. I'm in charge of the prison now, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just guessing, eh? Like, why was he allowed to do that? Oh, God. The, I, uh, I just realized with stuff I ever watched, I've become fucking cinema sins. Ugh, oh, ugh. <laughs> just Ding. wanted to go talk to his buddy. Ding. Ollie's not giving me a lap dance right now. Fuck off. <laughs> Wait and hope. You got it. Uh, need a better book. Yeah. <laughs> These all end with philosophical quotations. Can you get me Dr. Seuss? <laughs> I will not shoot them with an arrow. I will not push them with a barrow. All right. Wait. See, now this is going to be uncomplicated. Oh, fuck. No, it's the one about the Cold War. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Hello? That does nothing for me. Well, you know that that that's that's the uh, sound cue of uh, I've been in this show before. <laughs> You're not wrong. I think it's Diaz. Why don't we have a little phone call with me and my Yorkshire flat cap? So, do they think you're my like common law husband or something? Is that why you're allowed to visit me? I'm looking at this dude in the face, and I'm just seeing Jimmy Fallon. I don't know why. <laughs> okay, yep, the man said out there, I will not flip out, don't you worry. They don't just allow anyone to visit visitation in prison. Like, you have to, like, have some kind of relation. What What's their deal? Hmm. Oh, I'm just his drug dealer. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's cops, prison guards, be telling oh, okay, yeah. I'll allow you. Oh, please. Everyone here is on drugs. That's good visitation. That's good enough. You're, 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 you count as family and friends. I'm here for a conjugal visit, mate. <laughs> I need to look up this Diaz person, because the name does not ring a bell. Nah. Ricardo Diaz. Thank you, Arrowverse Wiki. Arrowverse was the first uh, oh. result in, I'm assuming, an original <laughs> yeah. creation. I had just read a spoiler. Yeah. I probably could have figured that out on my Ouch. own. Yeah. Way to go. Yeah. Well, it just says species, human, and then their status right next to it. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. 
Okay. Boy, they they got to figure out some way to look <laughs> around that. Mm-hmm. Uh, Ricardo Diaz, also known as the Dragon, was a ruthless star city drug kingpin and criminal mastermind. Well, who knows? Maybe it won't happen in this episode. Maybe. Oh, you should have said that name. Prison guards are just like looking at this and thinking, well, what the, what shit do they get up to? Yeah, they're they're getting pretty intense. Like, he seems really into it, whatever he's saying. Why is he speaking into it like that? Don't let him go. I was just testing how many times I could do it before you stopped me. Yeah. So we're not going to investigate why he was doing that then. Yeah, don't investigate why. And, you know, no one was listening to the fact that he was very clearly threatening Mm -hmm. a bunch of shit. Okay, we're going down this way now. I have decided to be evil. I'm going home. Yeah. I'm going. Prison is my home. I'm always fascinated by, like, how do they film stuff in prisons? Is there an actual prison being used? Like, do they just have uh, a large no, swathe of, like, empty cells? No, yeah, yeah, this is just a set. Okay. Uh, filming in an actual prison... Uh, well, for one thing, actual prisons wouldn't look like this. Yeah. Uh, and... The film in an actual prison. I mean, you'd have to go find an abandoned prison. Is yeah. the thing, and an abandoned prison would definitely not look like this. No. But you know, always keep in mind movie magic, the power of illusion. They 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 only build, uh, up to like the periphery of what the camera is going to be looking at. Yeah, that's true. And uh, a lot of the uh, prison-esque lighting is probably uh, done in post. Mm-hmm. So, like, this whole, like, green filter that you associate with prisons. Oh, boy. So what you doing, Alec? What did you have hidden in your soap? It's just a prank. The soap is an egg. Yep. Amazing they didn't catch that one. Yep. So has he created a bomb or? (laughs) (laughs) That's not how they did it in the Shawshank Redemption, actually. I'll I'll have... I don't... (laughs) That would that's 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 an interesting cut I want to see. Uh, instead of like methodically uh, digging a hole and then uh, breaking out with the thunderclap with the rocks against the sewage pipe, <laughs> yeah. he just like MacGyver's together a fucking lock breaking thrown weapon, and then just fights everyone and gets out. <laughs> that sounds good. I will not go back in that cage. I must sling arrows. Oh, it's fight scene time. Yes. Damn. Oh, that really hurt. This would be so much easier if I was Spider-Man. Yeah. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Are you sure you're not superhuman? (laughs) I just love the... you, you old well, mister, your early release is certainly not coming. And you're certainly you've, you've not getting se- boy. certainly not getting second helpings of dessert, that's for sure. Yeah, run, Ollie, run! Oh, sorry, wrong show.
I'm trying to act over here. <laughs> Uh oh. He says while holding a gun. <laughs> He's got good presence, this guy does. Yeah. Shouldn't have interrupted me while I was making the speech. You know, we could call, like, the governor's office, ask for, like, SWAT, but... Yeah. At this point, it'd just be embarrassing. <laughs> well, if he kills the SWAT as well. <laughs> you know, if we don't handle this ourselves... Then we're gonna we're gonna look like fools. Y yes, yes, they did. Okay. Yeah, we didn't hear you the first time. Where's Bane? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, do you? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I like that idea. I'm gonna make him pay. I'm Vinnie Jones, and I'm gonna make him pay. Ooh. Ooh, that's good. I'm going to use that. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so now, for all extensive purposes, Ollie is Batman. Well, you know, not being allowed to use Batman but having Green Arrow just means Green Arrow becomes Batman. Yeah, that's kind of true, honestly. Yeah. Hello? I mean, although they, 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 uh, considering Crisis, I know that they, that, 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 that means they've probably had the, uh, rights loosened up a bit so they could use Batman shit. Yeah. Uh, consider, I, I, I think, I imagine the reason, like, they couldn't do anything Batman was because of, uh, Gotham was running at the time. Maybe, actually, yeah. Yeah. But uh, now that that's because as soon as that went off the air, they said you no, know, they started working up the crisis, and now there's Batwoman is a show, uh, which uh, the premise of that is pretty interesting. And I haven't watched any of it, but uh, the premise is that uh, Bruce Wayne has been has uh, been missing for like five years, yeah, and uh, Batwoman is like <laughs> just. Basically doing what he's... Trying to do what he's been doing. Oh, is that the one where she's like, oh, men always take credit for stuff women does, and then she steals his suit? I... I don't think so. <laughs> I'm not sure. Again, I haven't seen any of it. Yeah, I'm Knife Man, with the power to knife. <laughs> All I know is that men always taking credit for the things... That I'm, I know that's a line in the Emoji movie. I, I shudder to think that it might be in a CW DC show. <laughs> Like, how low can we go at this point? Come on. Okay, well, fuck this. I'm going to the medic. Oh! Yeah. Yeah. I guess the pepper spray isn't affecting him, though. Okay, I like that. That's cool. <laughs> I mean, I could have ripped that door off its hinges, but since we're going for the subtle approach. Old action camera is on here. Look at it shaking about. Oh, yeah. I don't even know who you are. Maybe you do have enemies. <laughs> but I think Green Arrow has better enemies. <laughs> oh. 
Uh oh. Should have done that. Well, what was that? <laughs> she do that again. Yeah. I will hit you with the remote. <laughs> it will be a little painful. For you. <laughs> Ollie, I will hit him with this walkie-talkie. Oh, don't make me think I won't. What? <laughs> Sorry, you make me confused, Oliver. Really confused. I will give him a light smack on the head. And he will have a boo-boo for many days. Oof. Yep, that's the sound of someone blading out, all right? Dude, you don't have to shout. I can yeah. clearly hear you on the walkie-talkie. God shoots arrows. <laughs> can I get you a lozenge or something? I've been meaning to ask for a while, though. Yeah. Why are you... S <laughs> I'm going to break the walkie-talkie! Just having an episode right now. Well, it is an episode near, but I'm Tish. <laughs> Just put a number in the bottom right of the screen, ticking down. Uh. Oh, fuck me. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Oof. Well, they're dead. Uh. They're just having a rowdy party. Riot in the background. <laughs> They're just having fun. fun. <laughs> yeah, there's no there's no guards here to beat up or anything. They're just running around because <laughs> that's just what you do. Let's find a guard and like kick him in the shins. <laughs> I hope in the background we just see like someone do like a really cool run up the wall, like kick flip, <laughs> I and didn't everybody find, like clapping. I, I, I didn't think they'd put that in the episode, but here we are. <laughs> someone break dancing in the background. <laughs> All right, carry on. <laughs> it's not quite Daredevil single take escape from prison, but I'll live. Yeah, that episode was so fucking good, Jesus. Oh God, that was season three, right? I think so. Season three, I think of Daredevil was like the perfect end to the whole thing. Yeah. Uh, I I I still think my favorite season is season one. Mm. Honestly, the second episode of season one, like you just you could like make very few changes, like just cut in a few bits of episode one, that'd make like a good Daredevil movie. There you go. I don't fucking run for nobody, alright? <laughs> Come to me and get punched. We want the Daredevil audience. <laughs> Give it to us. I will fight you for it. That guy was just in his cell. You didn't have to <laughs> kick him. <laughs> like, he was just looking at what was going on. I was like, oh, fuck. Don't, well, you took it out, which means he's definitely going to bleed to death. Yep. And again, he clearly doesn't care about killing. Yep. <laughs> Right, come on down now. If you cared about lethality, you wouldn't be using arrows. Yep. No, it's okay, they're all rubber tipped. I don't think that's how it works, Ollie. You fire something at a very huge velocity, they're gonna die. I think. I never was that good at science. <laughs> I mean, all my other men died, but thanks, I guess. You know what? Your early release is back on schedule. I'm sir. thinking about it. Maybe I'll <laughs> eat a cupcake on top of it if we get out of here alive. <laughs> Didn't realize you were friends with Luke Cage, Ollie. 
I'm sorry, it just keeps reminding me of Luke Cage for some reason. They barely look alike, either. <laughs> I watched a couple of episodes of Luke Cage. I liked it. I don't know why I never went back to it. Yeah. Uh, too bad Iron Fist happened. Yeah, too bad Iron Fist happened. Woof. We could have had a fucking Dial H for Hero. Yep. Fun show. Yeah. Nope. Iron Fist. <sighs> well, hopefully, uh... Shang-Chi or whatever it's called works out in Marvel's favour. <laughs> what did... Oh no. He uh, just stuck me with Giga Raids. Ouch. <laughs> I trusted you. You little prick. With a little prick. Who gave me a little prick. Anyway, you're very rich. Can I have some money? Yes, I'll let you go for a, a quintillion dollars. That's not a amount. Uh, just, just give me some stock in Queen Industries, and I'll immediately liquidate it. Okay, I'll take a ham sandwich. I'm so fucking hungry. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to behave in our cells, and then they'll think, wow, you guys didn't partake in the riot. And then... And they'll let us out. They'll let then, us out, Ollie. And then it's cupcakes for everyone. Ah, shit, I'm bleeding. <laughs> yeah, took it in a little bit too deep. Watch the hand. Watch the hand. To get a bit closer. Maybe I'm the gray arrow, huh? Yes. Okay, so this is Stanley Dover, the Star City Slayer. Gotcha. He's buffalo billing hard right now. Puts the lotion on its skin, or else it gets the arrow again. Thank you. That was unnecessary. <laughs> I could have got out at any time, Stanley. You should know this. You're a violent man, the Queen. <laughs> Just playing with scissors over it. Yeah, I was busy. <laughs> you see, this is just really making me want to replay Arkham Asylum. Yeah, oh, fuck you. Yeah. Oh, man. If we ever do a playthrough of that, you're the co-cub. Hell yeah. Oh, if only Zaz, like, just, like, <laughs> stuck Batman with the hypodermic needle. <laughs> uh, that would that would have ended a bit differently. Mm -hmm. Alright, Grey Hour it is. <laughs> So I'm thinking, uh, Black Arrow? <laughs> eh? Sorry, sorry. Eh? Green Arrow doesn't take sidekicks. <laughs> and back to the show. Oh man, that was not the coin I needed. Oh no, my, f my precious giblets. Uh. Yeah, guys, I'm bored of this now. Can you like the riot, like... Uh, in the uh, common room? Yeah, I'm pretty sure the warden has an N64 here. <laughs> Fuck yeah, Smash Bros, let's go. Play Iggy's Wrecking Balls, fuck yeah. 
Had a bit too much fun with that go. I've had a cadaver. It's just not working. Yeah, you've been hogging the computer, Diaz. Can we, like... Can we download Minecraft? I like fucking with those blocks, you know? (laughs) I'm gonna be a human creeper if Ollie comes back and go kapow. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, that's certainly one way to get his attention. Welcome to the madhouse. Oh, wait. Nope. (laughs) I've suffered quite a lot. Oh, my mistake. You know, you're free to go. Ow. That's suffering. Okay, you, you may not be showing it. Yeah. But I know that hurt. Get a hobby, man. Jesus. Well, you know what, punching you actually? I think that's all. Did that was catharsis? Yeah. Alright, that's a wrap. I'm ready to move Let's on now. I'll get a therapist. <laughs> All right, well. What are they stuff in the pillowcase? Yeah, I'm not entirely sure myself. Is it the can? The can of, like, fizzy drink? <laughs> You've been fucking tangoed, mate. <laughs> Rope don't make that sound, I'm pretty sure. Ridiculous. What an interesting pulley system <laughs> we've <Seriously. laughs> Please don't credit me as the fucking pulley. Don't. Okay, I guess... You, so you're... You're a clever engineer, aren't you? <laughs> yes. Ow. <laughs> oh, it hurts so much. Um, I'm pretty sure it will. Holy shit, he has video games. That changed my mind. We're not breaking out of prison. He's got a hell of a setup. Pretty sure I should be electrocuted by doing that, but oh well. (laughs) No, 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 you're bricking them. No. (sighs) My rig. I'm never going to get Windows 3.1 working. (laughs) I go through so many prisons trying to do retro games. Oh my god, that guy is dead. Oh, hell. Fire stunts are always awesome. Dude, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, he Well, is... I didn't do it. <laughs> it's not like I made the fire happen. Though if I could, <laughs> that would be pretty awesome. I would. Yes, definitely. Multiple times. <laughs> Thank you. I found it on the on the floor. <laughs> no, it he looks was, important. He was playing with the scissors. I guess one for him, one for uh, Olu. <laughs> Just don't run with him. Right. I'm telling you now. It's a good thing they never called anyone. Yep. But I hope that the fire department doesn't get alerted by smoke. Yeah, like Diaz is wow. like ab- about to lay the finishing blow on Ollie and gets blown out a window by a, a fire hose. <laughs> I just... Wow. I mean, like, they had... It is really... Okay. Listen. If any, if anyone who, who does work on a... <laughs> large network TV shows is watching this commentary. Uh, please don't do a uh, real fire practical effects stunt uh, in your in the pre in the scene prior to your very quickly done digital fires. Yeah. They become very noticeable when we just saw the real thing. <laughs> mm-hmm. 
Oh. Like, I am just seeing the fucking, like, Yuletide Logs <laughs> TV channel, like, superimposed. Uh, okay, yeah, okay. An episode of Arrow. Oof. Me heiny. I'm coming down. These are video game fires. They, they sure are. Why aren't they my... spreading? Mm. Uh, Please. That's that's the key. That's what, Ah, shit! Why do you keep going for the <laughs> arm and not the heart, exactly? You were wrong. No, he was wrong. I didn't need it at all. It's just causing me pain. Yeah. It's okay, Batman will be here any second. She's stuck in traffic right now. You like that? I'm gonna beat the shit out of you. <laughs> Let me get up, sir. Oh, oh seriously? Oh, that is not I helping. Fix a crick in my neck. Oof. More? What you say? Okay, quick bathroom break, actually. Yeah, yeah, actually, just need a piss. <laughs> okay, what? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> kicked him with the force to flip him up? I don't know. Maybe Ollie tried to do a little, like, a, a flip, a backflip to impress him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, digital fire is a my thing, though. Yeah. You've been walking into my trap, Diaz. You're right in swirly range. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm gonna shove your head in that thing so hard. No, memories are being bullied. I didn't like that. No. The photograph. Huh? He was so in control of the situation until that one moment. <laughs> Ow, my head. Well, at least your head hurts more, I think. One last mirror kiss. Mwah. Uh. Well, looks like he died in prison after all. Okay. Please get off the toilet. Are you using it? Because <laughs> I need to go. Fucking hell, Leo. <laughs> <laughs> Can't forget my book. It's well overdue at this point. Alright, hold on. No, you should stay in the cell. It's your cell. If you stay in it, they'll show up and they'll think, Wow, Ollie. Good job. Oh, he's, he's twitching. He's he's fine. Okay, so he'll be fine. He didn't die. Uh, maybe. Who knows? Who knows? Indeed, mate. Stanley. Have the feds arrived yet? Take the sweet time. <clears throat> Well, I guess if they've ever got the call. How long would it take them to notice that the prison is on fire and has a riot going? <laughs> uh, it's like 10 of those going on at the same time in Star City. You know, just, just count on, like, the cops just not looking. A lot of stuff. How often do they check up on us without the prison telling them to? Yeah. Think about it. Once every couple of months. Maybe we'll establish our own micronation. Maybe. And they won't be able to... <laughs> what are you in establishing <laughs> micronations? I swear, it's like once a month. <laughs> oh, no, not Vinnie Jones, whoever he was. <laughs> oh, uh, just, just cleaning up now. We got it under control. Yep. We don't... No one has to tell <laughs> the mayor, the, the governors about this. No one tell the president. No one tell the feds. Hey, that that's an appropriate book. Sure is. That's a very appropriate book. Hey, that's also about a guy who was in prison and then brought out. 
Although he was in prison for like 15 years. So, just got back from a lasagna party, as you can clearly see. So, Count of Monte Cristo is a really good book. I'm sure it is. Written by uh, the same guy who wrote The Three Musketeers. There you go. We were going to let you out of prison, but you know. Yeah. Because I use scissors, isn't it? Oh, there's a the fire department. <laughs> but fucking, Took them a while. Fucking time. Oh. Wow. So I can just go? Yeah. All right. Uh, there's the FBI. So, yeah, they cleared him. I like to imagine this was actually several days later. Yeah. <laughs> it took that, like, that, that long to clean everything. Th- they're letting him go because he's he was the first one to, like, figure out, okay, I found a phone. I'm going to call the FBI and tell them <laughs> that the prison has been on fire for a while and every all the guards are dead. <laughs> I'm sorry they didn't. <laughs> they just let me go without uh, letting me shower. It's a very poorly run prison. <laughs> and John's just standing there watching them make out. Ugh. <laughs> <sighs> So, yeah, Season 7, Episode 7 of Arrow. A rip-roaring good time was had by all. Yeah. Uh, I didn't uh, really know the niceties, the details, the finer stuff of what was going on, but I had a fun time. Yeah, it was fun. It was fun enough. Again, yeah, weird episode to jump in on, but uh, it's uh, the the action was pretty competently done. Uh, I liked the... Uh, the uh, choreography of that uh yeah it wasn't bad was pretty good yeah uh and uh acting seemed strong uh i I've, I've only ever seen episodes of flash and this seems about on the same quality level which is pretty good indeed right uh the next time we return to uh the cw verse will actually be for elseworlds part one with the flash so stay tuned for that but for now we are done if you want your own patreon tv com or quick look hit up patreon.com forward slash elf icons and we'll make a little something work if you got the cashola to do so i suppose see you next time for another batch of these bye bye